All right, welcome back to the Crypto ZX channel, to the Jasmine community. You know, one of the most powerful communities that I've come across, and I will explain what I really mean. Uh, but um, you know, if you're new to the channel and you guys are enjoying these, um, you know, technical analysis videos, do smash that like button. Let me know down below what you guys personally think, and if you want to see more updates, um, do let me know. Uh, but let's waste no more time and talk about what's happening for the price of Jasmine. So if we're looking at it on the uh, daily time frame, um, you know right before we uh, close out the month um, you know this is the second last day you know, we're looking at Jasmine up once again one of the top performers in the top 100 coins uh, up 21.1 percent we're seeing a little bit of a pullback uh, from a massive massive rally that we have recently seen for the entire market but overall things are looking mega bullish for the entire space but Jasmine is up 21.1 percent and of course this is bringing in more attention to itself um, you know obviously after being up 21.7 percent that's going to bring in more attention and if we're looking at on the weekly time frame up 61.2 percent and on the monthly time frame 262 percent and i think if i'm quickly looking at the top 100 coins you know jasmine is the top performer in the top 100 coins as of now so of course that's worthwhile noting um you know for the jasmine community but let's take it a step further and talk about what's happening with the price and of course what is yet to come so looking at the price currently sitting at almost 1.9 cents uh, up 25 percent in all three comparatives bitcoin usd and ethereum comparative market cap approaching the billion dollar mark as of now it's seeing a little bit of a hard time actually getting back above the billion dollar mark because of course we know the billion dollar uh, mark is a psychological market cap uh, you know when it comes to crypto whether it's stocks anything you know it is a psychological price point so you know, that is uh, something we need to keep in mind in the 24 hour trading volume currently sitting at 426.8 million dollars not bad at all but before we go into it any further as always just a quick disclaimer anything on this channel is not financial advice all Always do your own due diligence and research when you are investing in cryptocurrency. So you guys know my stance on Jasmine. I've been quite clear about this in my recent updates. Um, you know, but I did a little bit more digging into it because a lot of viewers and you know what I meant uh, earlier in the update is the power of this community is massive you know people don't like you know when you are talking even a little bit negative about the project you know people don't like that uh, you know the community is massive and that is of course a huge plus point and i've been quite clear about the reason as to why i've been quite clear about that is because you know at the end of the day hype factor plays a huge role and jasmine has it for itself um right now um but you know a lot of people brought up some great points um but as of now am i really sold you know, I start to see, you know, there has been some credible um, sources that, and I, again, you know, as you guys know, on my channel, I keep it neutral. You know, I'm not just going to come here and say, you know, it's mega bullish uh, when it's really not, or I'm not going to just say it's mega, you know, bearish when it's really not. I'm going to give you guys my personal thoughts. And at the end of the day, this is my personal opinion. But, you know, apparently there is uh, some sort of a connection with the uh, Japanese government where the Japanese government is actually, you know, showing importance to jasmine actually realizing what jasmine could do for its markets and uh, um, you know and that is of course where people's excitement is coming into play but with that said now hear me out with that said that still doesn't justify this is what i still don't uh, understand and i will not understand um, if you don't like hearing that then that's up to you but that still does not justify this massive drop this massive massive drop that we have seen this is not uh, you know, something that you can be ignoring. Um, if you start realizing this, that's great. But this right here was a massive, massive uh, manipulation, in my opinion, from the team. Uh, because you're looking at, we're talking to millions, millions and millions of uh, coins that have been uh, unlocked over the past, you could say, two years. And obviously that has created more sell pressure than uh, it would have uh, if it wasn't this much of uh, coins that have been unlocked. So, you know, this won't justify. It doesn't matter if it's uh, Japanese government like showing them importance or acknowledging them. You know, that does not justify anything. And I'm going to clearly say that from the beginning and I will continue to say that. But um, with that said, now the best thing. You know, the tokenomics are not looking as bad, of course, now. Reason why the tokenomics don't look bad is because we're very close towards its total supply. So in the upcoming future or even new investors coming in that want to speculate on Jasmine, you know, they're not going to have that thing in their back of their head that's, oh, hold on, you know, uh, circulation supply, you know, is not looking too good. The tokenomics don't make sense. 
but you know now that is something that won't be a worry for a lot of people and I've been seeing people that you know were looking at uh, Jasmine in the pre previous bull market but the reason they never got into it is because solely of the tokenomics so now you know the same people are saying you know they are looking more uh, you know eager to you know actually speculate on it rather than before and this can be a huge huge player um, for it to obviously you know move in this upcoming bull market and of course guys you know a dollar price point is a huge huge target to make don't um, you know just go by if someone is saying you know a dollar is a hundred percent certainty and because guys that is a huge statement to make we're looking at I really hope you guys understand what uh, it needs to do to get to uh, you know 40 uh, I'm sorry in order for it to get to a dollar price point it needs to get to almost a 50 billion dollar market cap so now let's kind of go look as to where that would be so it needs to be at the market cap of Solana currently yeah of course you know as you go further into this bull market you know market caps will go up as prices go higher uh, but getting to um, that level in my opinion is hard unless we hear a huge catalyst right some of these things we need to keep in mind if we hear a huge catalyst we could see something um, you know crazy happening uh, and you know obviously that's where we can't write it off again that's speculation um, uh, completely uh, but you know these are some factors we need to truly understand don't give yourself false hope that's what I want you guys to uh, pretty much do um, like I said you can't write it off but don't be having your targets set only at our dollar so you miss out massive gains before then because if you're looking at just the next key resistance level itself you know the next key resistance level itself is about hundred and seventy percent away and I personally think Jasmine has what it takes to get to that level and I think you know it can get there quite easily with the momentum that it has on its side right now and of course the market momentum that we're in right now uh, but and that would guess what that would put it in an all-time high for its market cap and that's what you want to realize for its market cap for the price it might not be an all-time high but for the market cap it would be an all-time high so of course that would be exciting uh, I definitely think it does have legs in itself and I've been quite clear on that we could see some crazy gains happening this bull market but you know a dollar is a little bit of a stretch and you know you need to be making some exit strategies for yourself don't listen to uh, you know your an uh, ordinary Joe that just came into the crypto markets like you know yesterday or like two weeks back and it's just like telling you guys oh yeah you can, uh, if you've both done your due diligence and research uh, into Jasmine and, you know they're telling you yeah you know one dollar is hundred percent certain absolutely not nothing is certain um, and you know if I were you I've been in the space for about eight years I'd be locking in profits when I think uh, you know the prices are um, looking good uh, in your opinion right at the end of the day everyone has their own uh, targets but honestly make an exit strategy make an exit strategy because I still have this gut feeling that this is completely highly highly manipulated right now because of course the entire market is pumping and if anyone is looking at the four dollars seventy nine cents uh, you know all-time high and you're thinking that that's where it's gonna be that's not gonna happen like I would be and again you know I would love hear me out carefully I would love to be proven wrong you know I would love to be proven wrong I want people to you know get uh, you know wealthy you know reach their goals and stuff like that but you know there's sometimes some things that are just completely unrealistic and you know this is one of the unrealistic things that you need to keep in mind but definitely upside uh, you know potential is definitely there but you know you need to kind of uh, keep it in the realistic zone so that's my overall take right now of course you know we hit a new yearly high speaking uh, for itself in terms of its momentum next main resistance in my opinion is at the 2.15 cents and if that's able to clear up I think we can go all the way up to almost three cents now, you know in the very near future so those are some factors you need to keep in mind as far as Bitcoin is concerned Bitcoin has a lot of momentum at this point we don't even need to uh, give Bitcoin an introduction because it hit a new yearly high absolutely amazing as we expected uh, and you know I could not be more proud uh, you know of BTC but that is it for today's update let me know down below what you guys think do not spread hate guys again that's my own personal opinion truly try to understand what I'm saying um, of course if you guys have any opinions or if you guys want to say something um, let me know in the comments and I will kind of take a look at that. Love you all. See you tomorrow. Been Crypto ZX and peace out.